Pangit ka dito ah. Not that pigmented, dude. Hey ladies! This is Rina and for today we're going to do a rain check. For today, we're going to review stuff from Maybelline Beauty Glaze and Makeup World. Lagi naman ang madaldal, so alam ko baka naiinip na ngayon or you don't like long chats. So let's go ahead and dig into the first product that we're going to review. This is a new product from Maybelline. It's the Superstay 24-hour full coverage foundation. Baka ramihan ngayon sa mga drugstore makeup, nagre-release na sila ng mga full coverage um, foundation which cost a little less than the high-end products. So, yung foundation na to, hindi ko siya ka-skin tone or ka-match. So, hindi kami nag-match on Tinder. Joke. A little comparison with these two is that they're both in a glass bottle. And then, may difference sa consistency. So, si Fit Me is a little bit more runny, I think. While the... Super Stay Foundation is a little bit thicker in consistency. That gives the effect na full coverage yung nagagawa nitong C si Super Stay while C si, um, Fit Me is a little bit more sheer on the sheer side. Super Stay is full coverage foundation, 24 hour wear, oil control, and shine or shine free, breathable and comfortable, sweat or sebum resistant, and doesn't clog pores. And it's also fade and transfer resistant. I don't think about the fade and transfer resistant. Before I nandiginamit ko to ng transfer siya sa uh, King Damit. So, I don't know about that. But kan inapply mo si super stay sa face mo, medyo mabilis siyang matuyo. And you have to blend it out right away. Kung hindi medyo mag mark siya sa face mo, and it will be hard to blend. So, Nag polka dots na ako sa face ko na foundation and we'll see if it will cover my foundation. Ay! <laughs> if it will cover my acne marks. Kanina, I don't know if you noticed but I have pimple marks here. And also on my under eye, hindi ako masyado naglagay ng foundation but I'll put on some later. So ayan, kita nyo naman na may pimple marks din ako sa side na to. Gotta say that this foundation really gives you a flawless finish. Ang flaw I think flawless thing na yung face ko pag malayuan. But again, if may nakikita pa yung spots or something na you don't like, it's okay na tagdagan yung pa yung foundation niya. So that is, this is it. <laughs> Masyad mag zoom in. Tapos na naman yung hindi ko kamatch na foundation. Tapos na tayong mag-blend ng foundation. So, kanina nakita nyo yung pimple marks ko sa fisngi. Sa fisngi ko and then here. But then, nung naglagay na tayo nung foundation, medyo nawala siya ng konti. So, maganda naman siya o oh, hindi siya patchy sa aking face. Let me know in the comment section if it really did stay for 24 hours since yun nga yung hindi natin matatest. The next one that I bought is their Age Rewind Concealer. So last time I bought the Fit Me Concealer which cost 250 but then this one costs 400 again. And this is in the shade medium. I don't know if it will match the foundation that I just applied on my face. May lakad kasi ako kaninang umaga. That's why I already used this. So, ang hype din kasi nito sa social media. Most of the beauty gurus sabi nila, holy grail daw nila to. So, why not try it? Na, konti lang din naman yung ginamit kong product kanina. Just to try it. Try lang. Try lang. Try lang naman. There's nothing wrong with trying. This concealer claims to erase dark circles and it's a treatment concealer. I don't know what that is. Pero kasi ngayon ko lang nalaman na may mga treatment concealer pala. It has goji berry and haloxyl. I don't know what haloxyl is. So, haloxyl is effective at reducing bags and dark circles under the eyes by more than 60%. So, Pag ito, every time or consistent kong ginamit at hindi natanggal tong eye bags ko. So to be able to 
get the product from here, you have to twist and shout and let it out. I'll get uh, no, copyrighted. I don't know if you could hear that, but kanina nang ginagamit ko to wala siyang ganong sound. But ayoko pa naman ng ganito may tono. I'm just going to use a foundation, flat foundation brush to blend it all out. So, ang napapansin ko ngayon, medyo nagiging streaky. I don't know if dahil hindi lang sila magkasundo ng foundation na ginamit ko or maybe because of this one. But maybe I should try using a sponge on the other side of my face. Para lang din mapag-compare natin sila. Wow! I like the coverage of this thing! For the sponge side, I'm going to use this sponge. Yeah, it's dirty. For the consistency of the product, it's thicker than the Fit Me concealer. It's a little bit sticky on this side, on the brush side. But here, hindi naman. It's cakey! Oh my golly! So, dahil nga cakey naman na yung face natin, why not cake it a little bit more? The next product that we're going to try on is... From Makeup World. So, this product is from Makeup World and it's called Transformation Palette. And ayan, medyo glittery something something yung package or yung name nung palette. And then it's in the shade Natural Glam. So, more on neutral shades kasi to. It has three layers. And then, sa each layer, meron siya ng eyeshadow. Meron na din siyang lipstick palette. And meron na din siyang um, two blushes na nakasama. This is what it looks like inside. So, may mirror na din siyang kasama. And for the second layer are the lipsticks. From nudes to pinks. And a little bit of the purple sides of the things. Then, yung dalawang blushes is nandun sa bottom. For the swatches, let's... So, it's a little bit creamy. Creamy yung texture niya. It's a little bit powdery. So, I think this costs around 200 or 300. So, next, second layer. Alright. Nandun sa second layer yung lipstick. Yan. So, I'm not really a fan of their lipstick. So, medyo, I ewan ko kung nakikita nyo siya. Pero medyo nagpapawis siya ng konti. So, ganyan yung kulay niya dahil sa ilaw ko. Sa lighting. Wait lang, patayin natin yung ilaw. Yeah. So, yan yung true colors of lipstick. So, maganda siya pagka sa skin mo pinapahit. But then, nung tinry ko na siya sa lips ko before, it's really on the sheer, shy, sheer, sheer side. And it's a little bit glossy. And it also smells nice. Ang sweet. Sa lipsticks, not really a fan, but sa eyeshadows, pwede na siya. For beginners, at lalo. Hindi ka ma-intimidate ma sa sobrang dami ng colors. So, next! Blushes. So, yung light pink medyo glittery siya. And it's a little bit chalky, I think, or powdery. Ayan silang dalawa. So, yun nga gaya ng sinabi ko kanina, I'm going to use this as my transition shade because we're going to head over to the Beauty Glazed Eyeshadow Palette. Primer's already on. I'm going to set it with the lightest shade on this palette, which is this one. Ang daming fallout. Next, I'm going to use my blending brush and use this one as my transition shade. Oh my god. Dami. So, for our next product, I think this is the fourth product that I'm going to review. So, this is Mars by Beauty Glazed. So, Madami tong ano eh, parang collection and it's also like the Huda Beauty eyeshadow palette. All of the eyeshadows in this palette are in the shade of red. Never swatched it really, wala pang fingerprint yan or anything. So let's go ahead for the swatches. I'm kind of excited for this kasi yun na nga medyo dupe daw siya ng um, Huda Beauty. Huda? Huda? 
Huda Beauty. Yung um, shadow ng Huda Beauty, I don't know what the collection is called, but yun nga. It also comes in other shades. Meron silang blue, yellow, violet, and I think pink. And all yung, yung names nun is puro planets. So, Jupiter, Mars, Venus, something. I'm really not prepared for this review. So, first touch, creamy. Swatch, not that pigmented, dude. I like it. I'm liking it so far. Except for the first watch that I did, pinake niya ako. This one's a little bit rough. Yung tatlo kasi medyo makinis sila. Oh shit, it's so matte. It's so freaking matte. So those are all the shades from this palette. Alright! Let's get started with the eyeshadow of the night. Pinabi na ako ano oras na. I'm just going to use this light pink first. Lagay natin siya after no transition shade natin. After this shade, I'm going to use this one for the outer corners. So, the next color that we're going to play with is... Yung kaninang gustong gusto kong i-try kanina pa. Like this one, right here. The darkest or the maroonest five of them all chart. The maroon shade. I'm just going to put it here and here. On the outer and inside corner of my eyes. And also I'll be using this for the lower part of my eyeballs. Set lang sa lamin na yun nandito sa harap ko pero bulag na bulag pa din ako. So let's go ahead. After that, for the center of my lids, I'm going to put on a shimmery shadow, of course. I'm just going to put on some concealer and then I'm going to put on a pink eyeshadow on top of it. You know this trick. Like... Flat brush and then the middle part. Joke lang, this one. What? And I like to transfer then sa brush. I'm just going to use my finger. And also, iba yung consistency nung shade na yun. Medyo jelly. Mas lumabas yung color niya nung Ginamit ko yung finger ko. So, the middle part's done. So, for the highlight on the inner corners of my eyes, I'm going to use yung middle shade. Wait. <laughs> this part. So, this is it for the eyeshadow makeup. I'm just going to finish it all off with um, some liner and uh, falsy. And then, We'll head on over to the last product review of the night. Alright, I'm back! Yes, and that's not energy. Whew, I already did my contour, so my highlight and everything na din. So for the blush, I'm going to use the one in, in the Makeup World palette. I'm just going to use this corally pink. Diba ang dami niyang nakukuhang powder? Like, ang dami ding excess. And then, the color pay of though is very pigmented. And then last but not the least is the Maybelline Superstay Matte Ink in the shade 65 which is Seductress. So I already did the review or some notes about this product and I'll have it here na lang. But also, I really love this product as well kasi sobrang tagal nito. As in, ang hirap niyang tanggalin. I tried removing it with my micellar water but it didn't budge. Ay, medyo drying yung formula nito. Wrong shade na naman tong nabili ko but I got a little something or a little hack 
just to um, make it work for me. Nag-mix-mix na lang ako ng colors para lang bumagay siya sa akin. And also, minsan, ginagawa ko na lang siyang base para yung lipstick na gusto ko talagang isuot is medyo magtatagal na suot ko. para magtatagal siyang suot ko. Masa yun. So, I just put this on and I'll see you on the montage. Hope you guys enjoyed watching this and don't forget to follow me on my social media accounts hit like and subscribe to my channel and don't forget to ring the bell to get notified whenever I upload videos every other week month I don't know yun nga yung purpose no bell is para malaban nyo kung kailan ako nag upload diba? and I'll see you guys next time bye bye Thank you.